Ah, you're back. I am back. Okay, can't hang out with Coffee Daddy. Who is this? Ah, oh, dang it, it's Oya again. Why? Why? Let's get it. I'm beat. The higher-ups aren't happy with one-off articles anymore, so I'll be needing some more info from you. All right, we got little, and we're going to rank up. Let's go. Exactly. No one can disrespect Coffee Daddy. It's that we have two rules in this chat. We respect women, and we respect Coffee Daddy. Those are the rules. So that ace detective is serious, huh? I see. Oh, yeah, there's something I need to apologize to you about. You know, it's part of my job to research particular things. Well, uh... I ended up finding out about your criminal record. How dare you? I realized you weren't just some ordinary kid back with my chief. So I did some digging out of curiosity, and I found a ton more than I was expecting. Sorry. Sorry about that. I have to say, though, the ruling made in your case was really odd. Some kind of deal must have gone down behind the scenes to make sure that was the end result. That must have been tough for you to handle. You're just a kid. <laughs> well, just forget about the past. We're in the same boat when it comes to being labeled. Because of your investigation. Exactly. I'm going to avenge my partner for... No, I almost got her. Whoops. Lala-chan, refill. No, it's your turn to tell the truth. You can't go rooting around in the kid's past and expect to keep your own secrets hidden. Yeah, you tell her, Lala. Wait, don't blame me for that. He doesn't have anything to do with my private business. You can trust me. I promise. I mean, it's not like I don't trust you. And hold on a sec. Why am I getting treated like the bad guy? Because you're the worst character in this video game. Look, you're going to feel way better than talking to someone who understands exactly what you're going through. Besides, you'll explode if you keep all that alcohol-fueled anxiety bottled up in you. That's true, and I guess this is the fairest course of action for our business partnership, huh? Just don't tell anyone, okay? Back when I covered politics for my publisher, I had a partner who helped with photography, Kayo Murakami. We were a pretty well-known team in the industry. We blew the lids off countless scandals together. That's it, until the day came. We were on the trail of a certain bureaucrat who was involved in a slush fund to support refugees. He kept himself pretty well guarded, so it was almost impossible to get any solid leads out of the guy. Then one night, I got a voicemail from K.O. saying she had gotten hold of something big. But that was the last I ever heard from her. The next day, that bureaucrat was found dead at a love hotel, and K.O. had gone missing. Who killed him? Who did it? Well... The cause of death is unknown. The authorities wouldn't tell whether it was a... Couldn't tell if it was a matter of murder or suicide. As for the killer... Shit. The police accused Kayo. They said she killed him in a crime of passion. That's impossible, though. She never would have slept with a disgusting man like that. And more importantly, it's pretty screwed up to make allegations like that without any evidence. Ichiko Chan. Sorry. The case was closed, but we never found the truth. And Kayo was labeled a professional disgrace. And since we were partners, the company decided it would be best to move me to another department. I'm going to prove Kayo's innocence, though. That's why I'm conducting my own private investigation now. That is unforgivable. You're right. I'm always right. But thanks to all the info you've been giving me, I should have more time to focus on my investigation. I won't let this opportunity slip through my fingers. All right, we're even now. I didn't enjoy it, though. You sure about that? It's been ages since I've seen you smile this much. Well, maybe you're right. I haven't felt this alive in a long time. <laughs> okay, then. I'll write a great article to commemorate our sharing session. Exclusive. The Phantom Thieves. Lofty ideals and connections with a secret society. Haha, just kidding. Don't worry. I'll definitely come up with a better headline before we go to print. Sure, whatever. Just give me the rank up already. What is this? Rank five? Oh my goodness, I still have five more to go. In me. All right. Hmm. Still, there's just one thing that bothers me. There's no doubt the chief is on to my investigation. <laughs> Maybe we should keep acting like a couple so we can trick him. How's that sound? Please, no. no. I'll leave the kid alone. Hey, it's getting late. Shouldn't you be heading home by now? Thank you for saving me. Bow, ba bow. Bow, now, 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 now. It's Saturday. And it's blue. I can read again. Weekend parks. Hey. Book is about Inokashira Park, don't you already know? Okay, well, yeah, cool. I mean, like, you're not giving me much option left here. What about this? Hey. Oh, my word. I've already done everything. I need a guts hey. book. All right. Well, my only options are things about uh, knowledge. Good or evil, the threat of Medjet can be felt all over the world. 
Just danger afoot in the internet world too, it seems. Yeah, man, have you ever played a Digimon game? It's wild. Hey, hey. Bum bum bum, get me out of this. Alright, we good, we good. Alright, depending on who texts me, we might go work at the convenience store. Let's get started. Well then let's get class started. I hope oh, Kawakami's gonna isn't cheap. Well. Dang it, Kawakami, this is so worthless. You know what? I'm gonna make infiltration tools. Make some lockpicks, just in case. Okay. I can make one. Make it. Why not, you know? Three. I made three. My word. All right. He's done it. Can you please right. just give me more guts? I wish Pete was a persona. I agree. I was wrong about it was nothing you. in particular. Sorry for the wait. Let's collect ourselves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Thanks, Kawakami. I appreciate it. Bum 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 ba na 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 na. Ah, hello. Who's there? Can buy books from Jin Bone Cho. Don't can't remember if there's any that do guts though. Great. Hey, why don't we try asking Futaba Chan to look into the culprit behind the psychotic breakdowns? That's a great idea. Why didn't I think of that? Huh. I suppose Futaba's ability to process information is truly world class, after all. You're smart, Haru. I already tried. I was about to say she surely she has already done this. Did you find anything? I know so much now. It's hard to make heads or tails of it. Suspicious people appear, then they disappear. It's been that over and over again. So they're manipulating information to keep anyone from reaching the truth. Making lockpicks in class should give you a couple of guts, I wish. Well, there's one thing I know for sure. Whoever we're going against now is more dangerous than we can possibly imagine. Oh, no! All right, depending on who texts me, we might be going to the convenience store to try and get the information on that thing already. Yeah, we got time. We got time. Don't worry. Futaba. Very tempting to just hang out with Futaba instead. What's she at? We just ranked her up a second ago. She's at five. I mean, like, it'd be nice to get her higher. You know what? No, we're going to the convenience store. I've already hung out with Futaba once today. I've got to get this uh, thing available. Hello, I'm here to work. Hi there. We're having a huge sale on a lot of our hot food items, yada, yada, yada. I'll go to work. Let's go. Coming in today, that'd be so helpful. I'm on it. Welcome. Welcome. Do you have a point card with us? Please. It's all right, Kusukun. Calm down. What are, you, what are you talking about? I'm doing my job just fine. I do have this. Thank you. <sighs> hey. What's wrong? Uh, I saw a cat what? in the road a little while back. It was injured badly. When I got close, it got scared and ran off, dragging its leg. Anyway, I just overheard some college-age people in our store talking. They said there was a college student living nearby who abuses animals to relieve his stress. I will murder this man. And then I remember that injured cat I saw. I'm thinking maybe he was the one who hurt that cat. Unforgivable. I will strike him down. I know how you feel, but the police can't do anything without any proof. I've been thinking about that cat ever since. It's hard to keep smiling. You know, the police can't do it, but you think those phantom thieves could help? You got any info on him? Huh? Oh, yeah. I think the guy's name is Kazuo Suboy. Phantom Thieves will do it. Don't worry. Yeah, I guess you're right. For some reason, I feel like the Phantom Thieves really Good would. Oh, I'm sorry. It's almost the end of your shift, right? Good work. We've done it, boys. Hey. Good work. Very nice. Seemed pretty busy today. You remember what you talked about earlier today, right? Let's do it. Yeah, we can't allow this guy to abuse animals, and he's doing it only for stress relief. Play video games, you nerd. He's exactly the type of man we should punish. There's no way I'm just letting this go. Kazuo. Let's steal this creep's desires before he can harm any more innocent animals. Got it. Don't steal the heart, rip it out, and crush it before his eyes. I wish. All right, let's get our pay, and then let's be in the operation. Boom, money. We're going to have to be in the operation tomorrow. I don't think you can go to Mementos at night. Place too much cuphead. All right. I think we're going to go to Mementos tomorrow. That's what I'm feeling like. Because we have, like, four requests. Uh, That's enough for me. Back. Who texted me? There's lots to do. There's a lot to do with the shop. Can you help me out? You're free today. Let's go. It's been a minute. Hello. It's getting crazy out there with all those accidents happening. Well, it'll make my job easier if the cops have their attention elsewhere. Yada, yada, yada. Yeah, I want to work. In that case, let's do something around the shop. Yada, yada. Can we come closer with the Y since I have Orthrus? Bond is not going to deepen. You're always so tough to get the rank ups with the Y. Get closer, though. Boom, money, if only it were that simple. If only, man. 
All right, cool. We're ready for a rank up now. What do I have a Y at? Like five or six? He's pretty up there, isn't he? I don't think he's one of the ones that's below five. He might be at five. Oh, what is this? Who is it? There's going to be a festival in Asakusa tomorrow, and I'm thinking of attending. It seems they only hold it around this time of year. Would you care to join me? <sighs> yeah. Yeah. Thanks. I'll see you tomorrow. Good night. We need points with uh, Haru. Someone else might show up. Gunbro has a thick wall. Take some Mormon up before he'll let you in. Fair. All right, after this, we're probably going to go to Mementos. Um. I'm glad I could come here to return last year's Kumade. Thank you for helping me out, and sorry. Yeah, it was fun. No need to apologize. I wish I could say both of those things. No, I'm glad to hear. This festival is really bustling with people, huh? It's nice. Anyway, it wasn't the Kamade heavy. Father always bought huge, elaborate ones for good fortune. They even reported it on TV. We can't get a new one for this year, though. I'm thinking of buying one for the Phantom Thieves instead. Oh, that'd be nice. If we set that up in the hideout, I feel like something good will happen. <laughs> Man, my intuition is on point today. Please tell me it's not. No! <laughs> something drew me to this festival. Little did I know I'd run into the CEO's daughter, tangled in a case. And with that Prince Boring I've seen so many times before, no less. I think this means we need an interview. Please, end me. Leave Haru alone. Oh, how chivalrous. Is she your girlfriend? Um. Are you an acquaintance of his? What's this about an interview? How is that water bottle staying connected to your leg there? I don't see anything that's holding it to your pants. I've interviewed him before. I would have thought a high-class lady like yourself would be out of his league. She's my friend? Huh, I see. Well, it seems like I'm intruding, so I'll get out of your way, huh? Be wary of the mass media, especially when it comes to men. Oh, um, okay. It's fine. I, see. I sure hope so. Alright, well, you know, I needed boosts with both of them, so this is worth it. That was an interesting acquaintance. Yeah, you're telling me. Ah, so she cooperated with you too. Maybe I should have asked her to take a photo of us as a memento. Well, let's regroup and buy that Kamade. Let's get it. <laughs> This commodity is a bit different, but at least it's cute. Well, then, please put this up in the hideout. I will do it. Eventually. Thank you. Nothing to fear for I am here. Thanks for today. Yo, speaking of my boy Shroom, he's going to start streaming soon. I'm excited. He finally got a good computer up and going. Uh, I am definitely going to... Uh, I'm going to need to change the Nightbot command for his YouTube channel and change it to his Twitch channel. That reminds me, the home shopping pro- I don't care about the home shopping program. Who do you think I am? Remember what I said? You remember what I told you last time? It's about that man who visited the other day. That was Chairman Fukarai. Well, I'd, I'd like to talk to you about him. Are you free today? Yeah, we're going to rank up. Let's do it. Great, we can talk after I close up shop. Stop by then. Let's go. Shakes chaos? Um. I totally forgot about that, but like, what are the odds it was a guts shake anyways? So, I think we'll live. I've been thinking a lot about our last meeting, and I wasn't completely honest with you. I dared you look at Haru fan art now. <laughs> but I've decided. I'm going to tell you everything about fukurai -san, As well as the reason why I decided to leave my village. I... I already told you about how it was a small traditional town tucked away in the mountains, right? Well, when I was young, I predicted a major earthquake. The villagers revered me as a messenger of God. But when I kept predicting disasters, they started blaming me for everything. They said I was cursed, a monster. So I locked myself away. People would still come by to throw stones through the windows, though. That is awful! Things went on like that for some time, until one day an angry mob came and burned the house down. What?! That's why I decided to come to Tokyo after graduating high school. I wanted to change my fate. I didn't know anyone, but I needed money, so I took the first job I could find at a small nightclub. I found myself surrounded by dangerous people, but that's when Fukurai-san approached me. He's a psychic, too, you know. He knew from a mere glance that I was a runaway who had just come to Tokyo. Then once I told him why I decided to leave my village, he immediately invited me to join with the ADP. That was when he gave me the moniker of the Maiden of Relief. He told me that I possessed a divine power to save others from misfortune. That I could become more than the monster people saw me as. I broke down the moment he said that. <laughs> Deep down, I knew all along that the Holy Stones didn't have any powers. But I thought I might be able to save people, even though I was a monster. Or perhaps because I was a monster. So the truth is, I was only ever selling those holy stones for my own personal benefit. 
I'm a terrible person, huh? You shouldn't have tricked them. I figured. You're right. All right, good enough. But honestly, I'm glad I told you all of this. I really needed someone to talk to about it. I've made up my you know what? I see now how wrong I was. I'm not going to keep turning a blind eye to injustice. I'm going to expose the chairman's fraudulent activities and wake the other members up to the truth. Thank you very much. Thank you so much for listening to me today. If there's ever anything you need to talk about, I'd be glad to return the favor, Kurusu-san. No problem. Rank up. Is this rank six? Rank seven, let's go. Deepens your bond with a confidant of your choice. That is so useful. Especially when I've been trying so hard to max the confidants. Now that I think about it though, just saying the Holy Stones are powerless won't convince people. The ADP holds what they call seminars for believers, but it's really just brainwashing. That's why everyone thinks they'll be unhappy without a Holy Stone. Honestly, I don't hold any sway there, even though I'm the Maiden of Relief. Um, Just who is the chairman? Let me think it over some more. We can talk further next time. All right, good talk, good talk. Thank you. Thank you again for today. All right, rank seven. Let's go, boys. Jihai is getting close. Depending on what text messages we get, we might be going to Mementos today. See who texts me first. Three texts. Shinya again, Takemi, and my boy Yusuke. You know what? It's time. It's finally time, boys. First up, hit up the Velvet Room. It is friggin' time. Get me in there. Fan out, bow. Fan out, bow. Someone give me uptime in chat. I'll go. I'm estimating I'm going to need an hour to do the stuff I want to do in Memento, so I need to start before Time we get to the two-hour mark. Finished for Time for some yeah, strengthen Persona. Sacrifice. Strengthen my Moon Boy by getting rid of... Uh... Wait, wait, wait. Before I do this, Change I need to register. Justine, you have registration? You'd like to register yeah, register this? that. Whatever. Time for some rehabilitation. Power Strengthen. Sacrifice. Strengthen you by giving up. We can't do anything with Hifumi right now, so strengthen it with the star. This is what it shall become. Then let us begin. Let us begin. An hour and a half. All right, we got time. Become stronger, my elephant. Ever stronger. You're currently my best persona. Yeah, sure. Take that. Whatever. All right. Now, give me a death persona. Death, death, death. I'm pressing the wrong button because I'm stupid. Where's the death? It is way down here, my word. Give me a matador. That'll work. A little low on money, but we'll be fine for now. Let us begin. Save to make sure you don't date Takemi. How do you know that's not what I'm going to do? Want to check on your progress? Are you free today? A lot of my patients have gotten sick late lately. I'm worried about your health. Let's go. Sup, Takemi. It's been a minute. How you doing? Bruises, sprains, broken bones. I'm not a surgeon. I don't know if fall is the season for sports. Don't consider your age and don't overexert yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. Okay, yeah, yeah. I want to do a clinical trial. Let's go. I made progress with the medicine. Could you tag along for a bit? Let's get it. Time to rank up. What are you going to do? Are you going to hang out with Takemi? I am. Hang out with Takemi. I'm going to meet someone at Inokashira Park. I can say that word. It's close, right? Let's go. Here. All the data, specimens, and sample medicine. They're all there inside that case. Let me know if you need anything else. Based on what I read in the finding summaries you sent me, the results are truly amazing. We'll perform one final exam with our equipment and we'll be ready to treat Miwachan with it. Excellent. Then the rest is up to you. So, this is the kid from your study, huh? <laughs> yes, he's my little guinea pig. You certainly walked a dangerous line, but I'm sure you implemented the strictest of safety protocols. Please put some thought into the offer we discussed, will you? Alright, I'll call you later. He's the doctor treating Miwachan. He just so happened to be a year ahead of me in college. I told him everything since I was so close to perfecting the medicine. Thanks. 
I have to thank you again. All this is thanks to you helping me with the clinical trials. Don't worry about it, you know? It was fine. I see. Okay. Then I guess I won't. For my tour of their medical facility and discussions I had with their development team, I'm confident this will be a success, and they'll complete development on schedule. The final results will be out of my hands, though. If I don't accept their offer, that is. I was recruited. He offered me the position of head of research and development at his hospital, which means I'll have to close my practice. I start first thing next month. Unfortunately, Takemi Clinic of Internal Medicine will be gone. What about your patients? I'll urge my patients to transfer to that hospital, and I'll be sure to give them priority there. The protagonist is very tall, you're right. You seem flustered. Are you really that troubled by it? Just kidding. <laughs> The part about being recruited is true, but I don't intend to close my practice. I kind of like being a general practitioner. I'll still work with them to develop new medicine, though. Once the medicine's perfected, I'll be able to see Miwachan and receive my reward, her smile. What a good reward. I need to give you your reward, too. I'll think of something to give my little guinea pig for holding up his end of the deal. Feels like my bond with Takemi is growing even deeper. Let's go. One more rank to go, and we have another blood oath. All right. <laughs> 